I. Uh, I think I want to spend the start of this episode looking around for secrets. What I missed, basically. Let's try challenging this guy again. Maybe my speed 4 will be able to overcome his cheesy freaking Stop. way of going to the finish right Please. away. We're not even using same routes. I think that's not fair. Come on. Uh, who won? Not bad. You're getting closer to becoming a true speedster. Keep it up. I want us to grow even faster together. I will be here whenever you're ready to try me again. Okay. Surprisingly, I got him, but it was very close. Hello, hello, hello. I feel it in my core. Today is the day we pursue the ultimate in speed. We shall break down all barriers. Sound, light. Uh, how do you pronounce this? Takion? I think. I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't know what this word actually means. A hypothetical particle that travels faster than light. Ah. Takia? What? Takia? Takian. That's a weird word. Okay. Aha! Today we show the world what it means to be speed itself. Uh, can you show me where? Ah, okay. How do I go there actually? What would be the fastest route? Maybe like this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh, that's not good. Mm, well, it wasn't good enough. No, 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 no! You must fire off the great rockets of your soul. Fill your heart with emotional fuel and maximize your potential. Bro, what the f... Okay. Is this faster than falling? I don't know. I think I should upgrade my speed movement chip even further. This is not good enough. Actually? Ah, that was so close actually. I need to try again. Quit! Eating my killing items. Mm. Fuck off. Fuck this. I'm done. I need better chip. How do I get your quest? Okay. Not getting his quest. Oh, from Emil. Hello there. I'm kind of bored out of my mind over here, so 
How about swinging by the store? I've got some pretty good stuff on hand. Eh, probably, Emil. He sent me this before I talked to him, so maybe I should talk to him again. I wonder if I go to the cockpit city again, what will it have for me this time? Nothing? Or something else? <coughs> But there's so much things to do, I am kind of getting lost in what I should be doing right now. I thought that I would rush main quest, but some of my side quests are still there, so I should be doing them while they are still available. Okay, I don't think there's anything interesting here. Oh well. I think I know how to chase this guy. There is a consumer consumable that upgrades your speed. I should try using it. Uh, get up, get up, get up, get up. And use this item. Uh, uh, where is it? Ah, yeah, this one. Let's go. Ah, I think I lost too much time. Come on, come on, come on! Ah, I was fucking... okay. Stand up. I feel angry every time I fall. And I don't really have control of my movement. Come on, come on, come on, come on! This is so frustrating. Tripping over every fucking rubble this is pathetic shouldn't be a problem at all no! fuck off Bro, I fucking hate this. Hate this so much. I think there is no faster route than this. You can climb over the middle. You can climb over the right part. Only left one gives you access to go there. Okay. And if I eat it, I will stop anyway, right? So that this will not matter at all. Yeah, because of this fucking little pause, I keep losing speed. I think this is my worst attempt yet. Last attempt. <sighs> Fuck this quest. Fuck this quest. 
Hey friend, thanks for stopping by. You into fishing at all? For a while I ate whatever I could get my hands on just to survive, so I actually know a fair bit about the art of angling. So today I decided to let you in on some juicy info. So different areas have different fishing spots. As a rule you're usually going to find freshwater fish in rivers and saltwater fish in the sea. Oh, and you can also catch things like starfish or horseshoe crabs in shoals. But if you are looking for a huge catch, you will need to aim for the deepest depths. The pond of boiling oil in the desert are usually filled with machine fish, and most of what you will find in pipes buried across the world is plain old garbage. But if you keep at it, you might just pull up something good. And finally, if you are looking for rare fish, there are more exotic fish than you can shake a stick at in the subterranean lake near where I live. That's just a quick zip and zoom away from the city ruins. So that's it, I think. Later. I think he's talking about flooded city. Ugh, I'm so frustrated after that, for fuck's sake. Whoa, 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 watch your step around here. There might be ancient relics buried just beneath the surface. Hmm, me? I am researching the old world. You guys are with Yorha, right? Say, if you find anything in the desert, that looks like a relic. Can you bring it to me? I will find a way to reward you for the trouble. Hmm, have I found anything like that? Maybe not. Wait. You mean like literally scanning around this desert okay i thought i needed to go somewhere else <laughs> hmm looks like some kind of stuff that's pretty incredible. Let me pay you for your help. This was likely a tool used for some kind of ceremony. I imagine it belonged to the nation that used to exist in this reg region. If you find any more relics, make sure to bring them to me. A tech manual. What is that? Ah, a stone tablet with laws written upon it. That's definitely worth a reward. This isn't the only tablet of its kind that we have found either. I think the nation that once existed here lived under an almost impossible number of rules. The more they expanded their civilization, the more rules they had to come up with. They ended up living their lives bound by rules. Seems like a waste if you ask me. If you find any more relics, make sure to bring, a, bring them to me. Ugh. Will this ever end? Hmm. It felt like it was getting a little faster here in this place yeah 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 ah what's this way oh no what? Ah!
These guys give me the creeps. Oh, so hard. Wait, what the fuck? These uh, round things, they look like giant Emily's heads from the distance. Up close, you can't actually see that. So I guess this desert civilization was uh, near Replicant World. Wow. What the fuck? What kind of character is this guy actually is? So creepy. Maybe Emil that we have in Nero Tomata is not the real Emil, maybe. It's just a robot who got uh, inspiration from these stone statues and his mask resembles Emil because of that. Ah, this is just lovely. Let me pay you for it. Ah, so it's some kind of mask. Judging by the design, it was intended to be worn by a female. According to legend, the nation that used to be here was wiped out quite suddenly. Apparently it had something to do with the passing of a beloved king. Perhaps this mask belonged to a princess or the like. If you find any more relics, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Okay, these guys are actually threatening. <laughs> I thought they were level like 20. Holy! Triple laser actually used me for a very good amount of time. Ah, oh, but they're dealing a lot of damage too. And this is on normal. I'm glad I didn't raise the difficulty. That took a while. This is a statue of a young woman. Hmm, the words on your wedding day are carved into it. Perhaps this is a representation of the bride. This reminds me of something I have recently discovered in the course of my work. It appears that this area used to be known as Fasad. As the name suggests, the residents of Fasad all wore masks, as well as unusual clothes. They also spoke a language unique to their people. Anyway, listen to me ramble. Thanks again for your help. Please take this, okay? Okay, a new weapon. 
That's nice. I wonder what kind of civilization used to exist here. Oh, I am so tired already. <laughs> like, getting angry made me very exhausted. Gunman biped. A small biped that imitates human culture by dressing like something out of a western. Like any good cowboy, it attacks with a gun and seems to use its deep-seated head hat as a means of taking aim. Mysterious lithograph 2. Parents, parents shall not purchase birthday feast ingredients. We mask people have traditionally shown proclivities toward treasuring our children. However, due to parents purchasing far too many ingredients for the birthday parties of their children, much of what is bought goes to waste. This rule was passed by the king who was quite distressed by the ceaselessness of such behavior. Oh, I didn't know I actually can do this. I can hide text, actually. This one is interesting. I think this was supposed to be, yeah, idol that has both. Uh, I no, what do you call this? Like her, both her mouth and eyes are covered. So maybe she is operator that used to be a Yorha uh, combat model. of the usurper in a distant kingdom there lived two princess princess the son of the queen consort was clever of mind but weak of flesh the son of the king's second wife was dim-witted yet charming and quite gifted in the art of war and they both stabbed each other Wait, did I read this one? Is this the same description? No, not really. Hi guys, it's me, 42S, your favorite Yorha Squadron idol from North 12C Defense HQ. I'm here with the latest hot scoops from the front line. So let's get out there and do our best, alright? Go team! Hey ho, Battlefield buddies! I'm not gonna lie here, the current war situation isn't looking too optimistic, but we are expecting reinforcements from our orbiting satellite bases any moment, so don't give up yet. Glory to mankind! I'm sorry if I'm reading weird. I feel like something is my is in my throat. Like <clears throat> it's kind of painful to talk. So I will stop playing for today soon. Mayday, Mayday! This is publicity agent forty two S from North Twelve C Defense HQ. Is anyone listening? Our facility has been completely surrounded by machines. I don't know how much longer we can ho So did their bunker actually get raided by robots in space?
And this is a different idol actually. This one is 42S. This one is 24D. Okay. How does it look? Uh, princess body double used the spear to slay his leech and met his own fate on the same edge. Okay. <sighs> uh, only 33% of quests. Okay. Man, this game is gonna take forever. Okay, I'm gonna take a break for today and continue maybe tomorrow, so yeah. Let's try beating this fucker again. Apparently, good strategy is to double jump and then attack, so you will not take full damage and you can sprint right away. Oh, but that was not a very good landing. That's still not enough. Okay, fuck this. Like, no. I heard there is a tool that I don't have. That, uh, like a grapple, I think, and you can use it on him. I think. So, yeah. Maybe I will wait for that and maybe upgrade my chips for speed movement. And also I need evade distance chip, yeah. So my build for now is not optimized for the race. I will probably come back later, but at the moment I am very annoyed at this guy and I know that he has no lore relevance at all. I was told that, that I can skip his quest, and uh, I only want to finish because this is the last stage. Hey friend, did you hear all the rumors about the place with the trees and the bushes and the leaves and the castle built by the first machine king and the big old treasure? What is in there behind locked doors or gates? or modes or what not, and you wonder what it could be and boy howdy I'd love to find out and see it for myself, don't you know? Huh. Analysis. This machine life form believes there is treasure located in the forest kingdom. Proposal to be should investigate. I wonder if me not having 9S at the moment makes Pot more talkative. So he would provide his second opinion to replace 9S token. Yeah. Okay, and I think besides from escort side quests, I also lost side quests for. Uh, what was his name? Father Servo? Ah, yeah, Father Servo. I think he disappeared. I don't see his map marker anymore, and maybe I need to revisit him and see what is going on with him. Anyway, I wanna 
re-explore this forest kingdom see what new we have and then continue the main story and potentially while investigating uh, finish this sub that I just got Hmm, something new. You cannot understand the feelings of a machine. Only someone with hacking skills would be able to comprehend us. Only someone with hacking skills. You mean I need 9s here? And that's a mysterious letter. It's a second mysterious letter icon that leads to a elevator. I noticed that. Suzume! I think this ambient track is my favorite from all other locations. But uh, it's very quiet. It's a shame. This blade chip program is very good. But I also noticed that these people still talking about King. So they are not aware that their King is already dead. Hmm. Speaking of which. We haven't seen A2 for a while now. I look forward to our next encounter. Very curious what kind of role she has in the story. I hope that she will be the one who will open our eyes and possibly rebel against our HQ. That would be awesome, but maybe that's too predictable and story will go in other directions. I just found a new weapon. Dragoon Lance. Let's see. Another spear, huh? Ah, yeah, I didn't read this one. Uh, machine spear, a spear used by machine life forms. Uh, I think I did read this one, but uh, let's see the story. My name is Plato1728. I am a failure of a machine. I was designed for combat, but I can't use weapons. Everyone makes fun of me, and my life is horrible. Uh, symbol of the bond between a lord and an old dragon. Tracking guard reference? I think I have seen opening cinematic of Tracking guard maybe one, and I think protagonist was riding on the dragon, and it seemed like a medieval setting, so lens makes sense. A spear symbolic of the covenant between a mighty warlord and an ancient dragon. I had a dream. A dream about the day we met. He was small. He was insignificant. He was weak. Yet, he hated the world just as I did. I'm not sure that I will play Drakengard. Very, uh, very unlikely because I heard bad things about it. Like story is okay, music is whatever, characters uh, I don't remember, and then 
world building I think it was alright, but gameplay was completely atrocious, like I think it was required you to get all weapons, to get the ending, maybe even upgrade them all to the max and there was like maybe in Drakengard 3 that there was something about final boss that uh, <laughs> I don't remember exactly but I think it was like the scenery is going like black and white you lose your sight from time to time and you need to be able to do precise jumps and if you fail you need to do everything all over again and it was very annoying from what I heard and I saw some people uh, commenting about their experience and they usually say like I regret playing this fucking hell would be better if I watch a playthrough <laughs> yeah mm. The more old records I read, the more fascinated I become by the species known as humans. We machines must do all we can to preserve these precious artifacts and continue to record their contents. Yeah, obviously some robots were fascinated by humans and maybe regret killing them being in war with them maybe after humanity was mostly wiped out and they didn't have any to kill they started studying them that's why robots are becoming more human-like and trying to imitate them that's why they betrayed their creators Human fight. Why? Yeah. Oh, fuck. Should I? Was there something down there or not? Hmm. Not sure. I don't wanna die. But it seems like there's something down there actually. I don't remember being here. Well, that was misleading. Pointless. Oh well. I don't remember being here and I want to try killing their commander first. Uh -huh. <laughs> so they panic for a bit and then start fighting again. I see. I guess that's why BGM is so quiet. So it would reach its climax and become louder when you enter here. Oh yeah, maybe that's the treasure that he was talking about. I don't know how to reach there.
that really the oh the intended method to get here? really worth it I think I don't know why do I need memory alloy What is this location? I see that someone is outside of this gate. Hmm. I wonder where to get this key. Kikai生命体の部品。これは。ガラクタ。貴重なものではないが。森の国の財宝に関係する可能性あり。水晶。保管。Maybe we are assembling a new king. Oh no. Oh, these guys are so annoying. I don't want to deal with you. See how our blacksmith is doing. Come on. Do I really need to push this thing every time I want to enter there? I upgraded a bunch of weapons, so let's read their lore. Yet something nagged at the craftsman. Though he'd forged many a weapon, he'd only test them on pigs and cows. He wondered what it might feel like to use them on another human being. I see from these records how important predation and reproduction were to human survival, and yet they viewed such acts as sinful i wonder why yeah that doesn't make sense truly who could view, view this hunk of iron now that its edge was gone who might love it when all it could do was bash dully against a foe instead of cutting through flesh and bone who would devote themselves to such insanity The man's reputation spread through the village, despite never having drawn the blade. Don't make him use that horrid weapon, the villagers whispered. The man smiled at this, for he knew that fear was the best path to peace. Soon the man had craftsmen forge a host of similar weapons. He gave them, all, he gave them to all the other villagers in the hope it would force people to solve conflicts with words instead of violence and his plan worked for a while far away went my lover why humans love I am a dumb machine. I got lost during battle and ended up in some kind of factory. I found a whole pile of dolls discarded there. 
they share the same fate I do. Okay. Oh, actually... Now I can use two great swords. Nice. What is the difference? Endurance. Not what I meant to do. Increases defense. Basically, type free blade, I think. Mostly better. Actually, not really, because Virtuous Treaty is still faster. Safe. Okay. Not gonna waste time on you guys. Did I miss a treasure? Fuck me if I did. Oh no, there's two more of them. Okay, let's see. So they are supposed to be in chess. They are not related to the scanner. Nice. This is a ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。ナイス。
I guess this one is guardian and king is in this grave so maybe king wasn't a robot maybe it was human here lies the forest king Ernst this exalted individual was the earliest among us to awaken to his own view and for this reason did we name him our regent. Looking to sow the seed of this view in others, his highness distributed his own precious parts. His retainers were the first to be so blessed, followed by his subjects. And in doing so, he brought forth a paradise, one made for machines alone. Through his gifts did we learn of the thing called ego and eventually of our own selves. And just as ego gives way to emotion, so too did emotion lead us to feel great loyalty to our king. But our king was too great and too kind. Having distributed his parts, it became difficult for him to function and he soon fell into a deep and silent sleep. Now the only path left to us, his loyal vassals, is to construct a kingdom of eternal peace, one which lives up to the magna magna magnanimous heart of our king. And so, as a sign both of our resolve and our gratitude, we leave in this place a chip made from our combined parts. Your spirit lives on in us, O great king, and so we implore you to rest in peace. The forest kingdom, its citizens as one. Okay. Ah. Was that unit unique? Doesn't seem like it. Okay, let's go back to that guy. If his quest is still active, that is. Yep. Fucking hell. I <laughs> return to Pascal's village and I keep pressing scanner to scan. And I almost killed this NPC. Be because after transporting my skill is defaulted to this I think I need to change this this almost ended up very badly See that this guy what I definitely saw what was his name Jean Pierre I think I saw him here and now he's not here anymore there is no meaning in war Jean Paul's right did I scare them? Did I fucked up? Can I reload? Where did I save last time? Uh. Fuck. That's not a good save. Let's try re reloading again. If I scared them away permanently, this would suck. It would mean that I need to redo whole quest in second playthrough. That would be very bad. Okay, he's back. Is this a bug? 
I can't talk with him. Was he not supposed to be here at all? Or maybe he's like, you attacked me, so now I will not talk with you. Fuck. Yeah, I have no idea what is going on. Let's end this subquest. And unfortunately, it's late for me, so I will stop playing for today and continue main story next time. Oh, hey, you, you found the record of the king of the forest. Gosh, that's swell, just really swell. And I guess you defeated his royal guard for me too. Ah, gosh, thanks. A lot see, cause I can't really talk so good if you haven't noticed, which maybe you did, and everyone else pretty much won't talk to me cause of it. And who cares about that Forest Kingdom idea anyway? And who does that dumb king think he is? And all them guys are better off dead anyhow. <laughs> so thanks. Again for making all them guys extra dead. Cause they were a bunch of idgits, and who gives two boats about them? And here, take this for all your work. Cause they had it coming, 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 they had. This is a creepy guy. How are you related to Forest Kingdom? Are you weird because you were the king? Nah. Hmm. Because king sacrificed parts and he couldn't function anymore, right? Anyway, very creepy music is playing near him. That's interesting. <sighs> yeah, so I'm gonna stop playing for now. And tomorrow can I hopefully will continue and do some nice progress. So see you there. See him flying. <laughs> That's cool. When he was talking about beating, <coughs> being cut off of the network, we reached the point where to be connects to the network. So androids have their own network, and if that's a good thing or a bad thing is still unknown. Hope you guys are not talking about Eva. Eve, I mean.
小さいこちらの通路をお進みください。This track played in amusement park, I think. Classical game trope where NPCs that you need to escort. He walks faster than your slow walk, but he walks slower than your regular walk. Don't get killed, Pascal. Wait, this was an elevator that I couldn't use before, I think. Gonna fight. こいつらやはり私の予測は的中したようですねしかし興味深いこんな特殊な思想を持つ機械生命体は見たことがありませんきっと貴重なサンプルとしていいから逃げるバカこちら 2D 廃工場跡地で適正機械生命体と遭遇脱出ルートの確保を要請通信環境が不安定救援信号ルーパー陣了解くそ君たちの信念ためになるのだ死後の世界は素晴らしい死ぬことこそが最後の手のなのだ死んで神になれみんなで神になろう僕たちも神になるのだ何者だろう This track was playing in this first level in factory. Ah, okay, I'm not gonna attack those who do not attack me. Ah, shit. Did he mean to do that? Yeah. 
I think they keep spawning. So they are some kind of cult. They probably do believe in peace, but they have a fucked up method to achieve it. Eh, I'm not into that, so let's go. Completed the road to peace. How could God allow this? I thought we were going to forge peace. Ah. So not all of them share this fucked up ritual. Your grace. Ah, why did this happen? Why did something so cruel have to happen? And casually we have a shop? Ah, how did it come to this? Please stop all the killing! I will provide you with anything you need. Hmm, okay. Give me some healings, sure. Why not? Please save me. That's a big ass place. Fighting in this condition is kinda hard.
通信環境が不安定で転送は使えない Let's see So yes, I am under the factory and there is still one more thing that I didn't find here Have you met this robot? I guess so. Ah, I was. I should have been using my scanner. Maybe I missed something new.
spawning. This ignores them. It's over. It's all over. Oh god, please restore them to their senses. I'm scared. What happened to everyone? God, I'm scared. What is going to happen to us if we die? Help me. Oh god, please. My god. His grace. His grace. Somebody help me! Wait... What is supposed to be here is it? I skip by not going to that elevator. Ah! Oh, thank God. No, don't attack blue ones. 
for fuck's sake. Thank you, thank you. Here as a thank you. Everyone has gone crazy. Be careful out there. Here, take this. should have been reading about these new units to have more context about them. Multi-leg medium model long range. A medium sized machine life form that has multiple legs, much like an insect. By emitting energy from the tips of the of its legs, it can move about as though gliding across the ground. There exist long-range types equipped with firearms and close-range types equipped with cutting arms. Mm. Axe equipped, small sphere. Nothing interesting. Hmm. Nothing new on this guy, just his design. Same for this. Hmm. The first king of the forest who rotted away in its deepest reaches. Left there through the ages, its body is covered in unfavorable unfavorable 
What? How do I say this? Unf unfavel un I'm having trouble troubles with this sound. Unfavum unfavumabu. Unfavumable. Quantities of mass. Uh, moss. The grave at its site contains historical data inscribed by the secretary of the forest kingdom. Secretary? Maybe that crazy talking guy in Pascal's village was his secretary? Okay, so this was the king, not someone buried in his gravestone. Gravekeeper, a medium-sized biped that guards the grave of the forest castle's first king, attacking intruders on site. The moss on its armor serves as proof of the many long years it has spent in this role. Okay. Nothing really too interesting. Yeah, who killed who? Looks like a boss arena. Design you meant to see him because of his big red eye. I'm not sure, but I think in this song, robots are chanting Kami, Kami, like Kami as God in Japanese, but maybe. I am mishearing because uh, in the soundtrack I think they usually sing in a made up language in the chaos language or something like that. to say from Pascal. 
Eh, this boss was very easy, but this boss theme was not bad. But I think I liked opera singer's theme better. But it was cool actually, like compared to the opera singer, they put a highlight on you and here it was total darkness instead. So it is somewhat memorable. What the fuck? Oh no! So now they are trapped in cells and are stuck in the cycle of torturing other robots. What the fuck? them at first I doubt that there's something new in this direction so let's head out They came back. I'm confused. What? Okay. I went a wrong way. <laughs> well, let's read about this guy. A multi-legged Goliath class machine life form equipped with two massive blades. By emitting energy from the tips of its legs, it can move about as well gliding across the ground. The unit sights serve as weapon racks that can launch missiles and other projectiles, while additional plating attached to the legs reinforces its weak armor. When the situation demands it, the unit can purge its this plating and transform into a spherical form, capable of spin attacks. So nothing really curious about his lore. For now, I have no idea what kind of connection he has. Oh, 
I wonder why it became like this. What influenced them to do this? そう。私はレジスタンスキャンプに行く。パスカルはどうする私は自分の村に帰ります。村の雑用をしなくてはいけないので。そう。バイバイ。あ、レッツミトーク。レジスタンスキャンプ。You got was if here or not? Was that a flashback or not? That's what piqued my curiosity. Was he here right now or not? And he was getting corrupted with some thing, black thing. I wonder what was sad. Maybe Adam was their god and after he cut off from their network, maybe they saw him die and they were like, damn, I wanna go now too. Well, I don't have any other explanations, so let's see what is going on in the resistance camp. Gladly, I don't have anyone that I got attached to, so if they are dead, eh, who cares. New robots. Am I imagining things or some of them had blood on their surface? Did you guys already kill someone? Okay, that unit wasn't something new. Pa -pa -pa -pa. 
They are not bloody, they just have some broken pieces. A machine knife form that has become violent after infection by Eve will attempt to attack androids as if they were prey. The armor plating on his head has been removed, revealing teeth-like metal pipes that nevertheless have no functionality as a mouth. It is theorized that either this modification was implemented due to self-optimization or that possibly some alien race created them in likeness to themselves, though neither of these are proven. I'm not sure that I see teeth. Oh, this one, yeah. This one has something. The machine life forms who formed a colony in the abandoned factory worshipped this particular unit as their founder. He has since ceased to function, which his followers take as a proof that he became a god. It doesn't look special to me. It looks like a regular priest. So, these people were humans, they were not androids like I suspected, <laughs> I guess. Still not sure about this, because androids could have blood and flesh in them too, like synthetic ones. Well, okay, uh, I'm sure no one relevant died, right? Like, uh, Red Hat's twins. Nice sleep. Really? <laughs> Uh, people are dying and getting eaten. Eh. Whatever, I will take a nap. Mm. Mm. Oh, actually, I'm kind of sleepy, so yeah, that's why I am being a little quiet. Oh, oops, I didn't mean to quit the game. <laughs> Shit. I keep misreading the question that is being asked whether you wanna continue playing or not. So I am always picking a wrong option. Oops. Oh, this fire doesn't deal damage. This girl died. I don't see anyone. Here she is, I think. ドゥビ。大丈夫。急に奴らがキャンプに流れ込んできて応戦したんだが銃が効かないんだ。敵固体からエネルギーシールドを確認。水晶建設物理攻撃。わかった。あなたは他のアンドロイドを退避させて。
cross teams that he got a uh, celebration. So we still have no idea if humans are still alive or not. That wasn't too hard. Did you really not have other Yorha units that could deal with this? Oh, we lost a ladder. I can't climb back here. Arigato, Tubi. That's got the yon. Eat time. Naniga. Wakaranai. Yatra.急にこの拠点に攻め込んできて何キャンプの外から聞こえたぞああ、なぜだろうな、そうです How do I beat you? Ah, you don't have uh, infinite shield like zone on factor head. Ow, can do that. Why just shoot you without physically attacking you? Ah, okay. And he's gonna deal the finishing blow like as if he saved me, as if I was having no trouble at all. Come here. That's fine. He became their core. I don't see his body at all.
えてくるのこの中でどうすればトゥービーさん聞こえますかトゥービーさん私たちの村がパスカル聞こえるクソオッケー Now, this is not good. I don't want Pascal's village to get wrecked, and I, I knew this would happen. Of course, this would happen. It was so obvious. But this kinda feels very epic, like. Almost as if this is a final battle. But. I know that this is only first playthrough, so maybe this will end in a failure. So we will have to re redo this to make everything better somehow. Uh, I'm gonna check if I'm actually recording. <laughs> yeah, I am recording, I think, so. <clears throat> Let's continue. Nine Okay, now this is this is dangerous. This isn't Eve. Where did you go? Oh. その統括しているユニットを破壊すれば全体の活動が停止するのおそらくポットイブの位置を特定できる報告位置はすでに特定地図にポイント完了私たちがイブを倒すパスカルは村を守っててお気をつけて強制通信を撒き散らしているみたいですおそらくこの強力な通信が敵の機械生命体を凶暴にさせているんだと思いますイブを探し出して破壊しましょう了解 You reckon if he will revive this giant robot and maybe combine with it? Come here. Let's fight. Ah, Kita no ka. O mae tachi mo omo da. Kon na sekai, imi ga nai. Ore ni totte wa nii chan, nii chan dake ga. Well, he wanted that. 
Explore. So it wasn't my fault that I was better than him, so that's why he died. Hard to hit him with big swords for some reason. Phases you have. Uh, okay, don't come close to him.
Interesting that these projectiles are not popable with bullets or laser. Shoot now. Can I destroy myself? Nope. So Adam made himself mortal. Why I disconnected himself from network? So if supposed to be. Well, nine is I think cut off him from network, so he's supposed to be mortal right now too. Oh. Music just stopped like that. That was cool. Got corrupted. A virus. Yep. Nice. Spice chat. Ibu no network bridge ni. Bridge yosen sare chatta mita ni. バンカーにあるデータで巻き戻ることはできるからでもそれじゃ今の君は戻ってこないそうだね汚染データをバンカーにアップロードするわけにも行かないかなあいいえさなたごとウェイトダイ、ゲティングストレンゴウ、シシ、ああ、やるがなくらいな、ああ。To be finally got some humanity in her.
Ok, ok. Always you say. Are you hinting that this is a time loop? That's why we have different routes in this game. Are we sure that you are still not corrupted? I don't trust you. <laughs> Maybe you are just pretending. ケイ this song Whew. okay i think this is the first main ending that i got mm. if i didn't know about multiple routes that there should be something new when I replay this game. I would feel like this is kind of unfinished. Mostly because we didn't get to see A2 again. I have no idea what her role in the story is. is. Sorry, <laughs> this song is very good. I have listened to it multiple times before and I knew about that the singer she actually is going to cry in this song and it's very emotional how how she was touched by lyrics and the story of this game so they left this take as one that they use in the game. I wonder if I should play next route in the English dub. I keep hearing that it's very good, especially 9S sounds exceptional in English. In Japanese he was making this impression on me that he's a, a fuckboy, basically, <laughs> that I didn't appreciate him flirting with 2B. So, as you notice, I wasn't attached to his character at all. So, I didn't, re didn't really care about him dying, but 
And also I think that to be caring about him is kind of weird. I don't know what kind of connection they have, like, I don't understand why would they be so attached to each other. So, I guess to be live through this multiple times, that this is looping, that's why she said that this always ends up in this way. But she was surprised that Nines actually resurrected within the robot network. I think I think she will cry here. I wanna listen. Or maybe maybe I already missed this while yapping. Or maybe it didn't came for now. Didn't come. Uh, also, we still have no idea what is happening to humanity. And HQ probably will not approve of 9S. Oh, here I think. Yeah, yeah, very soon. It's very cool that she sings in English too. I didn't actually pay attention. Maybe this was an English version of the song. I thought that at the start it was Japanese version, but <clears throat> I am confused. Was it changed from Japanese to English one uh, in the middle of the song? I need to listen to this again. Because I know that there is multiple versions of Weight of the World. Japanese, English, and the final one, I think, like, it includes a choir of... Do you say choir? Like, choir, I think. The chore? <laughs> Fuck, I, I don't know how this word is pronounced, actually, sorry. Mm, I need to check this... Uh, Acquire. Acquire. Damn. Really? <laughs> Didn't know that. Uh, it includes acquire of Square Enix or Platinum Games Studios employees singing. So, yeah. Uh, I was talking about that I think HQ will not approve of 9S now existing as a robot. As a mind that exists in the robot network so they probably still will kill him and he still has a backup data in hq so we supposed to have two nine s's right now and them meeting each other probably would end up not good okay let's see notification from square enix to all players, thank you very much for playing Nier Automata. We have a special message for you. This game has several different storylines that change each time you play. You have witnessed the air route, but there are still many story elements and changes to the gameplay systems you haven't seen yet. We highly recommend you play through again 
to witness the full near automata experience i hope you enjoy the rest of the game sincerely square enix pr voice change option added to the other options category huh? what excuse me to continue playing with the same save data you use to complete the game select continue and load that save data maybe the mean that i couldn't change the voiceover until i was done Huh? Wait. It felt like I heard something new right now. Hmm. Maybe I didn't pay attention to the main menu track, but I think there's something new, like... Very subtle s sounds. Yeah. I didn't hear this before. Okay, so that was ending A. Let's load this one and let's see if I can change voice changer. Add effects to voice playback. I have no idea what this means, actually. I'm gonna Google because this is interesting. Does it change the pitch of the voice for everyone? What the fuck is up with the voice changer? Okay, I need to be careful and not catch any spoilers. Is Yoko Taro trolling me? I unlock the voice changer and it automatically applies it. Uh, I set it to zero at default and change it as soon as 9S spoke. What the fuck is going on? Okay, so in the middle is how it's supposed to sound, like here. Setting it to zero makes them sound like shades from the first near. Pretty cool and weird. It's, it adjusts how robotic you want for 2B and 9S to sound. Cranking it up. <laughs> Sorry. Cranking it up. Oh, uh, crank it, it up all the way, makes them talk in beeps and boops. <laughs> huh. It's very weird. Should I do this? I can't stand 9S's voice in Nier Automata. When I found out that you can change his voice using a voice changer, I was elated. It's a thing of beauty. Given how dialogue driven the game is and its tendency to veer into the realm of ridiculousness, this practically adds play value to the game as far as I'm concerned. After spending an hour testing it out, I refuse to go back to 9S's default voice. I'm not sure if I prefer having him sound like a chipmunk or a demented circus robot. I like my options. That's... Okay. Amazing. <laughs> uh... But 
making this a let's play i think i don't know i should ask my friend's opinion maybe she wants this to happen but i doubt it i think she would prefer for me to play in different dub without voice changes yeah okay let's see if i can change the dub uh yeah here i will try english dub i will try it but i cannot promise that i will do whole other playthrough in english because i got attached to japanese one and if i do watch near automata anime then it will be very curse for me to listen to English voices in, <clears throat> in game I mean so <sighs> do I have anything else to say ah so for me this feels unfinished and it's intended I, I guess so ah do you see this uh, in the logo of this game in the title Like some letters are black and and it, I think it correlates to the corruption that if went through. I, I didn't never quite realize oh. how beautiful this world what the, is. Wait, 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 wait. The commanders put me in charge of your maintenance, ma'am. Will this have spoilers for that me? That means I'll be performing regular checks on you from now on. If anyone is listening to this, there's something I need you to do. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Fuck off. I think this thing is very spoilery. I will not watch it. <laughs> uh, okay, it showed me that you can play as 9S, I guess. And there were some new cutscenes that I didn't see. Fuck off. That's dangerous. Okay, so... Uh, in next playthrough, I guess some chests that are thick and locked, they will be accessible now and I can finish some subquests that I didn't do, like for Speedstar, fuck this guy, and uh, oh, I didn't have 9s to go through the elevator in the forest castle, so I guess we will play as him and go there and I didn't do father servo his last stage and there was a guy that in flooded city he was asking us a pass or something like that yeah I heard this game like destroys your emotions makes you cry like a bitch and I doubt that it will do that to me but I didn't see anything that would make someone emotional, honestly. Like, this route was very introductional. It didn't explain much. So I look forward to play the, this new route. And yeah, see what this game is about again. I hope that... It will have enough of new stuff that if I do continue this save, I assume that we are going to do every mission from the start, like abandoned factory again. Yeah, so I, I hope that it will not just be like play until if is corrupted and then something new will happen. That would suck. I wouldn't enjoy that, but I doubt that they will do that. Yeah. So my theory is about time loop, but I have no idea how it would happen. Yeah, so we will see what will happen next time. I hope that this episode was entertaining for you to watch, that I didn't bore you too much, and yeah. See you next time. Thanks for watching.